This video is powered by Canada Dry. All right, guys. So what you guys are currently looking at right now is uh, Minecraft gameplay of the Lagarith um, video or Lossless codec. Um, so this is the RBGA um, codec, and it's really clear. I actually like this codec, but I don't think it's the best one. I would actually recommend using this as a second best codec. So. Um, yeah, this is the RGBA codec. This is the second best that I found, especially when I record with Minecraft. Now, this is the best codec of all. You guys can tell the quality is much more crisp than the RGBA. Uh, it is the YV12. And um, I like this codec a lot because mainly because it might be, I think it's, it might be older than, or maybe, maybe newer, I'm not sure, but it actually records your files in, in a smaller, um, it gives you smaller files when you're recording. And I think that is partly because um, that is partly because of the actual settings that I was using while I was recording at 720. But it does it gives you smaller files, but like it reduces like let's say if you record one minute with RGBA and it's five gigs, then um, it would be like let's say around four gigs with um, YV. 112. Now, what you guys are currently looking at right now is the RGB format, and it is the worst, worst, worst uh, format to use to record games in DX Tori um, using the Lagarith codec. So, I don't recommend using it, but if you want to be a rebel, you can go ahead and use it. Now, this is also a good uh, format, and it is the YUY2 format. And, um, well, it's self explanatory. It sets I think it's a much more clear, crisp version of RBGA, and I think R RBG. No, what am I saying? RBG. RBG stands for red, blue, green. RBG, red, blue, green, red, blue, green. Yeah, it does. So uh, there you have it. That is it. This is the last codec that I'll be looking at today. So guys, be sure to subscribe, comment, and rate. Peace.